Twins and the Padres at Target Field on Tuesday. Phil Hughes looking to right the ship. He's lost his last three starts entering this one. But he begins Tuesday's game strong. First batter of the game, Everett Cabrera looks at strike three. And then leading off the second, Jed Jerko, he also goes down. Leading off the third is Chris Nelson. Guess what? Another K. I'm seeing a trend here. Leading off the fourth inning, you guessed it, another strikeout for Hughes, this time victimizing Tommy Medica. And the next batter, Jed Jerko, goes down also on strikes. Leading off the fifth inning, Yonder Alonzo, another strikeout, right? Not exactly. Alonzo gets to Hughes here. The deep shot to right center for the first run of the night, a solo shot. And the Padres up 1-0 later in the inning. It is a man at first base and two men away for Seth Smith. And down he goes on the wave and a miss to close out the frame. Now we go top six. Leading off the inning is Tommy Medica. Hughes gets him on strikes. And the next batter is Jed Jerko. He goes down again, this time on the foul tip. Hughes would turn in six innings of one run ball, scattering seven hits and matching a season high with nine strikeouts. Now we go bottom six. It is two on and two down for the youngster, Kenneth Vargas, as he faces Jesse Hahn. Blasted to right field. Gone! A three-run home run on a curveball. His first major league home run, and it left no doubt at all when it left home plate. And the Twins hope the first of many long balls for Vargas. Minnesota has the 3-1 lead. Now we go top nine. Glenn Perkins trying to slam the door, but Glenn is in a quagmire. The Padres have the tying runs on base. Two men away at the plate is Seth Smith. Gets good wood on it, but he lines out to left as Perkins picks up the save, and the Twins hang on as they win it 3-1 on Tuesday behind Phil Hughes as he snaps that three-start losing skid, improving to 11-8 on the season. The Twins have now won nine straight against the Padres as they could only manage a single run on a dozen hits, leaving 11 runners on base as their winning streak was snapped at three.